In this video tutorial, we will show you how to create a pop art effect in Illustrator. Launch Adobe Illustrator. Go to the File menu and choose Open from the drop-down menu. In the appeared window, select the file you want to edit and press Open. Choose the Zoom tool in the toolbar and zoom out. Scale the image to fit the page. Open the Image Trace menu in the Control Panel and choose the Six Colors option. When the trace process is complete, deselect the image and go to the Window menu. Choose Swatches. In the appeared window, click on the Swatches Libraries icon. Select the Pop Art Library from the Art History submenu. In the appeared window, select the color that you prefer and click on the icon in the top right corner of the window. Choose the Add to Swatches option in the appeared menu to add the selected color to the swatches palette. Repeat these steps until you have added all desired colors to the swatches palette. Select the object and press the Expand button in the control panel to convert the traced object into paths. Go to the Object menu and choose Gap Options from the Live Paint submenu. In the pop-up window, select the Custom Gaps in the Paint Stop At menu and set the number of steps. Then, press the Set Default button. Select the Live Paint Bucket tool in the toolbar and choose the color in the pictogram of colors above the cursor with the arrow keys on the keyboard. Fill the object areas with different colors from the swatches palette to reach the needed result. As you can see, the pop art effect has been successfully created.